I'm gonna try and do this in one shot. <laughs> um, I did this and I dropped my phone and I don't have time to merge the files. So I'm gonna do it all over again in one shot. Hi everyone. Um, it's been two long months since I've updated. It has been crazy, um, but everyone is doing well. Uh, my computer hard drive just crashed and I lost everything and it's just been hectic and I'm trying to deal with that. And I got a new job that I don't start until April. Um, and we're just trying to figure things out. So the babies are doing great. Um, Easton and Al are growing wonderfully. They're developing great. Um, they're socially amazing babies. Like they are just the happiest babies ever. Um, and they're great. Um, they're healthy and I love them to death. They sleep well. Um, they don't really nap well, but they sleep well. Um, we started food a little after four months. Um, they started purees. So, um, They've been doing that. I'm waiting for someone to pull it next to me and it'll be super awkward. Nope. Um, so they've been having purees and we've had peas, butternut squash, sweet potatoes. I know I'm missing a few. Um, oh, and carrots. Um, so far peas, carrots, and butternut squash are the top contenders. They hate bananas, apples, and sweet potato. So they're doing really well. Uh, Ella is doing phenomenal eating. Easton's still trying to get the hang of it, but we're just practicing. Um, they are still... Um, primarily um, on my breast milk, I'm still exclusively pumping. I pump anywhere from 40 to 50 ounces a day, and they take anywhere from 45 to 60 ounces a day. So they do have one bottle of formula a day. Um, usually only four ounces, um, is, like their smaller bottle, um, is formula. And it's just so I can have a stash in the fridge if I have to run out like today. Um... And I pump every four hours right now, and I'm going every six, and I can go six to seven hours at night, which is fantastic. So I'm almost getting to that eight-hour mark. I'm working on that. Um, so I got a new job. I don't start till April, but I couldn't um, ask for a more perfect opportunity. Um, I get to work and raise my kids at the same time, so I'm so happy about that. And um, I'm just like waiting. It's so awkward. Um, this person's totally parked in handicap and she totally just continued to park in handicap um oh she is handicapped <laughs> I thought she wasn't uh anyways um so yeah um and today marks one year since we found out we were having twins which was like the best day of my life second to them being born um I was one year ago today I made that incredibly emotional post on YouTube that I still get comments on um, going in thinking we had a miscarriage and coming out with two miracle babies so um, yay um, so yeah I've gotten questions not really if we're gonna have a third I was surprised because usually once you have one baby people are like when are you gonna start trying for the second but I haven't really had any questions which is surprising but I mean, I hope to do a more in-depth post, but we actually discarded our last embryo. Um, we made a decision that we don't want to go through IVF again. Um, I don't want to take away from my two beautiful babies um, the time spent to do IVF. I'm just not there, and I just didn't feel like it was right. And um, it was costing us an arm and a leg to freeze it, and I'd rather spend that money right now on our two miracle babies. And so we discarded it and we decided if we naturally got pregnant, fantastic. If we don't and we have these two amazing babies, then that is it and we are happy. So, um, you know, down the road we'll start trying, but I'm not, I'm not in any way, shape or form want to go as far as I did the first time. Um, I am just so happy with these two babies. They're perfect. So, um, yeah, I mean, everything is great. We're just busy and I'm busy and now that they're like not mobile but like they need me more I thought that they would need me less as they got older but that is clearly not the case um we're going through the stage where if I walk out of the room we start screaming um Ella says mama and I will I've taped her once but she clearly says it now when I walk out of the room she screams mama 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 so and then I walk in done she's fine she's smiling and laughing so um She's a very, very smart baby. Um, Easton is definitely a boy. He's definitely a little bit farther behind her as far as developing goes and, you know, skills and all that stuff. But he's he's on her heels. He's doing well. They had their four-month appointment and it went well. I did a whole update, which I do have. I can upload that. I just have to get it off my chip. Um, and they'll be five months on Sunday. So, um, 
we started food like a week after they turned four months and we kind of started it and they didn't like it so I spaced it out a few days and then we tried it again spaced it out a few days we tried it again and they just like clicked it just mouth wide open tongue down swallowing like it was it was it just clicked so um I know a lot of people are against feeding early and I got so much slack on Facebook for feed, starting before six months but my babies were not they are ready for food and so this way they can learn while they're still getting my breast milk and hopefully by six months six months we'll actually have it as a um a routine every day so yeah um but I am at my doctor's appointment I have the day the babies are home with hubby so I have to go to my hip doctor's appointment and hopefully I'll come out with some good news um or a solution to why I'm in so much pain um but I promise I will be on here more. But everything is going well. And I'm I'm still watching everyone on YouTube. I am stalking you all all the time. So um, you keep me entertained while I'm pumping and feeding the babies. Because I bottle feed them. So I need something to keep me entertained. Because they don't really care to do anything with me while they're eating. They just want to eat. So and then when I'm pumping, sometimes I pump 30 minutes. So it's nice to keep have you guys keep me entertained. So um... I promise I will be on here more, and I promise, I promise, once I get into a schedule, I'll be able to. I mean, this is the first day I've curled my hair since um, I was 30 weeks pregnant, so um, that was a long time ago. That was September. That was September, yeah. September 7th, 7-ish. No, actually, it was the week before. It was my birthday. It was like the beginning of September, so um, I feel pretty today, <laughs> um, and I dyed it, and it came out awful. I spent like a week at the salon trying to fix it, so I have to go to a different salon. I had an allergic reaction twice. It was a, it was a crazy mess. So, but I promise I'll be on. I'm watching all of you, and I'll see you guys soon.